Hi, you stream and YouTube that's about to go up there. Um, apparently yesterday, I just so happened to go to GameStop and acquire this game called Metroid Other M. It's a game that, you know, I catch my eye on and it's a game that I heard some mixed reviews. Like, it's definitely, like, not the same as any other Metroid game as this game actually has a story, as I've heard. Like, there's characters, there's dialogue, you know, it's not just, you know, straight-out exploration. So, uh, I've never played this game before, except for the 45 minutes you see up there on slot 1. Because, you know, I was just, you know, getting used to the controls or whatever. And the controls are weird. Like, I like I like it how, you know, you're playing it like just any other, like any other controller, because you gotta hold it sideways. Instead of, you know, like, looking directly at it, or pointing it, like, in, you know, Metroid Prime 3 or something. But, uh... Some mechanics and just controls are just a little off. Especially since, since you know, you're moving around in a 3D space. So, it's, it's, quite, it's quite weird, but at the same time... Eh. Alright, so, let's start a new game. Because, what's the point of this recording if I just, you know, start in slot one? It's like, you, you'll you be like, missing some stuff, and it's like, that's not fun. So let's go a new game and, uh, start it. And now it's just loading. Look at that loading bar. It's, it's amazing. Space! The final front. Okay, no Star Trek jokes. Meteors. More meteors. Uh, supernova. What am I looking at? That baby just got, or Metroid just got owned. By the way, I like I like this reincarnation of like the ending of Super Metroid. And high detailed CG action. What's that? Are these just game? What? G Wait, what? What are you asking me? I don't understand. Okay, Samus. Everything's normal. Oh, God! It's a. I woke to the familiar voice of a quarantine officer. Let's try sitting up, huh? 
slowly now. A dream. I had been reliving the tragic moments of my recent past. Thanks to the hyperbeam, which was given to me somehow by the baby, I laid Mother Brain to waste. And the explosion that followed destroyed planet Zebus, along with the remains of Mother Brain, the space pirates, and my long-standing nemesis, Ridley, and the baby. Come on, Samus. Let's go next door. This game reminds me of, like, Metroid Fusion, where she has, like, monologues to herself. Right, let's get started. It's Sailor Mo Moon! Samus? I don't know, am I? Let's start with a little warm up. Fine. Try a charge beam for me. Alright, so as you can see, this is like a tutorial of how to play this game. And of course, I already played through this part, so I know what's going to happen. But, uh, Try anyway. A charge beam for me. Yeah, charge beam. Hold the one button, you know. The usual charge stuff. The charge beam has like a meter now. Like, you see that meter that just went off on the top left corner? Yeah, you gotta wait for the bar to, like, get up before you can... Shut up, you aging guy. Um, and what's that? Did you buy these games or have you had them for a... I bought these games, like, yesterday. I, I just I just said that <laughs> in the beginning. Okay, and... There you go. And I guess do it again just to reinforce that. Yeah, hold the button and you, you shall get your reward. Sharp looking charge beam. Just the way I like it. Just the way you like it, huh? Glad you liked it, okay. sir. Morph ball next. Morph ball. Who could forget about the morph ball? It's the same thing. Go ahead and drop some bombs. And of course. Oh, I can jump. Oh, I got spider. I got spring ball. Awesome. I didn't know I had this. Yeah, I didn't know I had this actually. Bouncy bounce. I'm a bouncy ball. That's what I am. Okay. Anyways. Okay. Get out of morph ball mode and return to normal. As you can see in this game, I can lay as many bombs as I want. Unfortunately, because of this, this game decided to um, get get rid of get rid of the bomb on, jumps. Get out of morph ball mode. No, I'm having fun laying bombs. My God. Okay. Stand in the middle of the room. Okay. Well, I'm standing in the middle. <laughs> Surprised? No, I'm not. From there, kick climb to work your way up. Kick climb. This was also a favorite in Super Metroid. But this time, you know, you don't have control Just of... Just like uh, that, Samus. Yeah, you don't have control of... Uh, where Let's you jump to? I don't wanna. Ah! Uh, get out of here! Ow! My face! No! Get out of here! Yeah, that's right. Ah! Uh, okay, looking good. Thank you. I do look good, don't I? Let's check your reaction time. Do I have to? Dodge him. Dodge the beams. These are pretty easy. This okay. Those are the moves I remember. The, these mechanics are really, I mean, this is really tricky, um, whatever. Sense move. I don't like it at all, because it's really weird. Oh, and as you can see, if you do that nice. as you press... Remember how that feels. If you do that as you press the, I don't know, hold Next, the one button... The shut up! Fine, Here's missile test. concentration to replenish your missile supply. Yes, in this game, you don't get any missiles. Instead, you can charge your missiles anytime, which makes me very happy because I don't have to rely on, you know, pickups. All I have to do is just do this, which is awesome. One of your pesky buddies is lurking here somewhere. 
find it for me, huh? And this is and this is the only mechanic that retains true from the Metroid Prime series. Basically, you hold your Wii mode your pesky buddies is lurking here somewhere. And uh find you, it for me, huh? you look around like this. And uh apparently you gotta hold like the B button to look around, so uh I think he's over here, right? Yep. Little bastard. Say hello with a missile. Okay. I did. Oh, you want more? Oh! Oh, too bad. You want more? Oh! Like him off. Yeah, I did tick him off, did I? How about you try using a power bomb? Power bombs. This area is well fortified, so don't hold back. Okay, so power bombs are basically well, you remember them in Super Metroid, maybe. No, I don't want to jump. Ah! Allow adequate room around you during power bomb. I don't know how that really works. All right, Samus, that's it for the test. I think you have like infinite number of like power bombs. I'm not sure though. Looks like you took quite a bit of damage. It's unbelievable how well you've held up. I wondered if this too was a result of the power the baby gave me. Just call it the Metroid. Right, you're doing the meeting room. The big dogs are waiting. I gave your suit a polish so you'd be at least somewhat presentable. Not even a fragment. None of the baby remained on me. I knew it to be true, but still couldn't help looking at my palm for a sign. Never again would I encounter the baby. Never. The finality of it struck me once again. Mission completed. The planet Zevis was annihilated. And all Metroids were exterminated. A simple report. Almost dull even. But it felt momentous to me. You don't seem to be proud of yourself, Samus. You do talk like this all the time. I don't know how much time passed since then. Days went by in their quiet way. And people's recollections of Metroids and space pirates grew nebulous over time relegated to a past concern of the galactic communities. Nothing more than a faded memory. Codename Baby's Cry. A common SOS with the urgency of a baby crying. The nickname comes from the fact that the purpose of the signal is to draw attention. The signal was coming from a remote part of space. I altered the course of my ship as if this detour had already been part of my flight plan. Baby's cry. It was as though it was crying specifically for me. I don't... What's with the baby, um... What's with like the baby uh theme here? Baby this, baby that. Oh well. Well damn. That ship just got its ass kicked. I guess the game. Ooh, pretty CG textures. Mmm.
Alright, time to talk now, and yeah. When it goes green like that, that just means the game's forcing me to point the Wiimote. Anyways, time to talk for a minute. Um, it's so obvious when the game, like, switches from game, from in-game graphics to CG graphics. It's, it's so obvious, but I don't care. It, it, it looks nice either way. Alright, so, apparently, I'm on this chip, and, uh... I'm just going to take a wild guess and say this is where the main game is at. Because the ship's pretty big. So, who knows? Maybe it's not. Maybe we got multiple ships to go to. And, whoa, I just noticed if I move my remote like that, it does makes those things go weird. <laughs> That's interesting. Anyways. Okay. And now we're going to use the examine feature, which I think is very, very dumbed down uh, in this game. You remember all the scanning that I was doing in Metroid Prime? Well, not in this game. There is none of that. It's just a very basic scan system now. Just very basic. Galactic Federation. Yeah, the cool thing about this, I think, is, you know, the fact that, that the game allows me to do this, but whatever. Anyways, okay, let's, let's do this. I think I haven't passed this part. This part, I haven't played. So, uh, let's go on ahead. Oh, that's not good. Okay, let's keep going. We're pro. Oh, super jump in. What the? Okay. Hi. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here, princess. Oh. Remember me? God, it's a ste Anthony. stereotypical black guy. There's only one person who calls me princess. And that person is Anthony Higgs of the Galactic Federation Army. I haven't seen you since that last mission. Is this? Hey, and your buddy's here too. I hope that this is not a generic military Adam game. A general in the Galactic Federation Army. Not only a trusted confidant, but also my former superior officer. Yes, there was a time when I was enrolled in the Galactic Federation Army. And then I... Well, I was young and inexperienced. As the result of a certain incident, I left Adam's command and set out on my path as a solitary bounty hunter. What are you doing here? The first words out of his mouth were typical coming from Adam. Wait, is this the Adam? Question, I recounted the details of what had brought me to this place. Is this Adam from then like I asked what Metroid Fusion? Led the Federation here. That information is not for an outsider. Ooh. The word he so obviously chose, outsider, pierced my heart. Commander, we're all prepped. I really hope that this is not going to be a stereotypical military shooter, because that would make me very sad. Metroid's not a military shooter. Uh, no dice. I think our only option is to use the laser to slowly burn our way through. This is going to take a while. The electrical system here is out, and we can't get the barrier wall to open. We tried using explosives, but it's tricky to pull off without collateral damage. What we need is some way to focus the power onto one centralized location. Oh, okay, forcing me to do it again. Okay. Hey guys, I'm gonna show off my stuff now. Okay. I'm Samus and I guess I can shoot missiles. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna look around. Be just because I can. And uh Oh, oh, oh who's this? It's Adam! Okay. 
I guess that's only what I can look at, so. Missile the door! Ah! Uh! Why is he laughing? I hope I hope that's the case. All right. I'm going to go on ahead. Adam hadn't authorized it. But I decided to remain on site for the sake of the others. You're going to follow him? Come on. I mean, I know I know, I know you just established that he's your commanding officer or whatever, but yeah. Anyways, now the game now the game just told me I, I can't use missiles. Dick. Oh well. Uh. Okay, let's go over here just because I saw like I'm like looking at the map. If the ma I'm guessing this is that this means the door is. It can't be open at the moment. As it's... I mean, it's red on the map, so... I like this. It has, like, a map system like Super Metroid or... Metroid Fusion or Zero Mission. I'm liking this already. Open for... Oh, I might as well just say... Do not spoil anything for me. Thanks. I mean, like... If I open it from the other side... It, wait, is that what the map, uh, that door means? Means I gotta open it from the uh, other side? Yeah, if it is, then if that door means I gotta open it from the other side, well, I don't know how to get there. And, oh god, ah! What is that? Ah! Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Run, run, ah, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh my god, scary, scary. Ah! The fuck was that? That was, that was, I don't even know what that was. That was weird. What's that glowing thing on my map? What is that glowing thing? Is that, does that mean go up here? Blue dots are items? Huh. Well, where is this item? I don't see it. It says it's like right here, but I, 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 I don't know where it's at. I can't get it now. It's in the ground. Oh, uh, must be underneath the green thing then. Gotcha. I guess I'll come back here because I can't lay bombs because stupid Adams like you can't use this now. And uh, the hell is this? Oh, I shoot it. Okay. Ah, oh, shoot it. Yeah. Shoot it. No, I think it'd be easier if I look at it like this. Come on. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. All right. Uh More yeah, more fall still works, of course. Ed has not authorized bomb use. Let's shut up. All right. Let's go up here. Oh, looks like this door can't open. Is that even a door? It's not even appearing on the map, so I'm assuming that door is never going to open. Ooh, enemies! Go away, enemies! Ah! Ah, more of them! More of them! Ah! Run, run, run! Yeah. Okay. tip in the game if you know if nothing works work look around all right gotcha ah ow not these no ah shit oh my god these guys do a lot of damage my god 39 health already my god Something tells me I'm not gonna I'm gonna have like a hard time with this game. 
What's in here? It's a uh, bathroom? Okay, why is Samus doing that? What where is in here? There's nothing in here. What's in here? The hell is this? I There's nothing in there. Well, that's a rant. That was a dead end. Yeah, let's let's just put dead ends in the game. Whoa, what's that? Oh, okay. She does automatically, and I guess these things open doors. All right. Well, I open yellow doors by uh, pushing buttons. Okay. Sir. So, Kick climb. We we already went over the kick climb in, in the tutorial game. Oh well. Doesn't help to reinforce it, I guess. Let's see. Nothing over there. And more enemies. Ah Oh, why'd she look back? Oh that's why. It's closed. And let's see. Ah. Oh! Ow! God, these guys do ten damage. That's unreal. What is that? What's that up there? I see something up there. No, I don't want to look at that. I want to look at that. There we go. What is that? Energy tank. Ooh. What is that? Normal bomb. Well, wait a minute. Normal bomb. That means I can't get it yet, can I? No, I can't. Damn it. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, more enemies. Ah! That's right. Ah, get away. I'm like, don't know where I'm going. I'm not sure if I'm going the right, the right, the bit, the, the, the right, right way right now. I'm, I think I am though. And are these things jumping? These little bugs are jumping. Okay, I, I, I'm beginning to notice that the my radar on top, it goes red when there's like enemies around, and then it stops doing it and it makes a blinking noise when all the enemies are dead. Why the hell are they jumping? They're not supposed to jump. They're defying physics. Damn it. Let's see. Up here, I think. Let's see. I see an item over there. I want that item. Let's see. Uh, ooh, what's, what's over here? Okay, it's a door. Is that an item over there? Yeah, it is. What's what's that? Can I look at that? It looks interesting. I can't look at it. Damn it. Oh well. It's it's behind this door. No oh, well. I'll come back later. Apparently there's a there's a item over here. What the Is it is it above me? Where is it? What the hell? Okay. Apparently it's at the bottom. Is it? I mean... Maybe that block I saw was like a hole or something. Just continue on? Okay, I will do that. Because... Yeah. Navigation booth. Stand on the platform to save the game. Oh, this is a safe spot. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Got I got more health now. Oh, this is a long hallway. I don't trust this hallway. I don't trust this hallway. 
Oh well, let's go through it. The hell? Oh. Why are those random bugs? God damn. Stop being random bugs. Oh hi, it's you guys. How did you guys get farther than me? Whoa, giant eye. He's dead. Someone no shit. Thing attacked him. No shit, he's dead. Thanks for stating the obvious. What is that green stuff? Get away from me! Wow, this guy scares easily. It's obvious that there was some pervasive danger throughout the facility. It's obviously that I didn't that... know what had brought Adam here, but I did know that cooperation was imperative if we were to restore safety. Adam, listen to me. Clearly, this facility is in complete disorder. It might be too dangerous for your men to go alone. That's why I've. Why have what? Look at that. They're coming out of the wall. That's a lot of bugs. Oh, they're going on that eye. What the fuck is that? Open fire. Ah! Shoot it! Shoot it! Oh god! Oh god! Get away! No! Nobody likes you. Nothing's working. Ow. Ah. Take that. Nothing's work. Okay. No. I don't know. No, no. Okay, that's it. Ah. Damn it. Come on. Okay. Stop it. Missile use again. All right. Whoa. <laughs> it's just like it's just like uh, yeah. Anyways. All right. Gotcha. Let's get out of this place. Ah! Ah! Thirty-one health. Not good. Not good. Ow! 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 Come on. Come on, you damn remote. Point the screen. Ah! Yeah, that's right. Concentrate fire in a single location and freeze that thing. And Sam, you attack the frozen spot. Ah! Uh, okay. I'll. Yeah. Take that bitch out. Ah! Uh, ooh, sweet drive. Ah! Uh, yeah, take that, you bitch. Whoa, that was close. I'm taking it down, don't worry. Yeah. Kicking its ass now. Fuck. It's using his head now? I don't think so. You're gonna die, sir. Ah, oh, where'd you go? Yeah, take that. Ow. Shit. Oh, okay, I will. Gotcha. Okay. What the hell is that? Is that a beetle? Get out of here, beetle. That was... What the fuck? Samus. Hi. Looks like I'm gonna need to ask for your cooperation on this mission. Well, thank... But of what? I'm also going to have to ask that you follow my commands. Great. You don't move unless I say so. And you don't fire until I say so. Too bad. I'm not going to follow them. Damn, Adam. Any objections, lady? The thumbs up sign had been used by the Galactic Federation for ages. Me? I was known for giving the thumbs down during briefing. 
I had my reasons, though. Commander Adam Malkovich was normally cool and not one to joke around. But he would end all of his mission briefings by saying, Any objections, lady? He was joking, but others weren't. At the time, I felt surrounded by people who treated me like a child, or used kid gloves because I was a woman. And yet with Adam, I was grateful for the nod. My past has left me with an uneasy soul, and as a result, it touched me on some level that Adam would acknowledge that past by calling me something delicate, like Lady. And I knew more than anyone that every word from Adam was deliberate. My thumbs down was a twofold response. A sign of derision at being called a lady, and a signal of my complete understanding of the mission orders. The other soldiers were always willing to support me with easy smiles, despite the fact that I clearly had so much yet to learn. Among them was Anthony. In the face of his well-meaning behavior and that of the other soldiers, my response was to become increasingly bitter. I was a child, always with something to prove, a chip on my shoulder. And I was angry. I felt that if I let my guard down, I would easily be broken. And beyond that, I was scared. But even in the naivete of my youth, I could see in Adam's joking manner how close he felt to me. Adam knows my past, and he knows me better than anyone else. Confession time. Because I was so young when I lost both of my parents, there's no question I saw Adam as a father figure. When I rebelled against him, I knew I could get away with it. And his paternal compassion in the face of my rebellion reinforced the special bond I felt with him. I understood well that chances were slim that I would ever find anyone that understood me like Adam. And yet, when the time came, I still left his side. I was so young. Young and naive. Why does this remind me of, like, teenage angst? Exactly what transpired here on the battleship is still uncertain. Here's what we do know. The equipment we thought had been destroyed is operational again. And we've seen casualties attributed to an unidentified and lethal creature. The situation is critical. We need to gather all the information we can, but priority one is to find any survivors and bring them to safety. Consider this site extremely dangerous. Be careful as you make your sweeps. And there's one problem. The wireless interference in this facility is all pervasive. Your comm systems are useless. As a result, communication channels will be limited to the facility's navigation booths. Well then, Lyle, investigate Sector 1 and show a little restraint with the explosives. Gotcha. Maurice, you cover Sector 2. Repair any equipment you come across. Affirmative. Anthony, you're Sector 3. I'll leave it to you to decide whether plasma guns are called for. All right. James, check out the control bridge. Our communication issues might be the result of electrical interference. Yes, sir. And KG, run a complete sweep of the residential quarters and investigate any trace of survivors. Got it. Each of you is authorized to use a freeze gun. Do not forget to check in regularly via navigation booths. And Samus, you go to the system management room. Do everything you can to get the electrical system back up and running. Looks like your comm system is still functional. Remember, everything you see will also appear on this screen. Regarding auxiliary weapons, the use of bombs has been authorized. As far as your other weapons go, we will continue to investigate and authorize use as we can. However, we currently have no plans to authorize the use of power bombs. 
As you know, they have the ability to spread a high temperature heat wave over a large area, impacting living things. Which is a nice way of saying they can vaporize humans instantly. You should be well aware of how dangerous power bombs are, and how their devastation can't be obstructed with common materials. Once the mission in the system management room is complete, I need you to report back. I'll give you your next orders then. I want you all to be especially careful as you execute your missions. That's the end of the briefing. It was the first joint mission I'd been a part of since becoming a freelance bounty hunter. And of course, it was the first time since my Federation days that I was following the orders of a commanding officer. Having received mission orders from Adam, I felt confused and strangely exhilarated at the unexpected turn of events. Hi. I responded. Understood, Adam. Why? No objections, of course. We're gonna play for three hours again? Oh, right, I got bombs. Awesome. Okay, so we got bombs and shit, so now we can lay bombs, so uh, Samus, head for the system management room. I don't I don't want to right now. Okay, this door is locked. I'm guessing red just means it's locked, like no way through. What are you doing? You need to get to the system management room. How about you shut up? Because I'm looking around. God damn, hippies. Ah! Wait, oh! Ow! What are the odds? What are the odds? Shoot them! Alright. Ooh. Hmm, what's this? Can I go down here? Yeah, I can. What's this? Missile tank acquired. It only goes up by one? Really? Okay. Missile expansions only go up by one in this game, apparently. Huh. All right, let's save it again. All right, we're, we're gonna stop right here, guys, because uh, my sister wants to go and play <laughs> with her console. So, uh, yeah, sorry for the short broadcast, but there's nothing I can do. So, I might continue this later on when she's done. So, you know what? I definitely will, because this game is intriguing. It's it's making me interested. So, with that being said, this has been... No. She want No. I'm going to let her play, just so she can get out of the way. So, uh, you know, I can have it back earlier, and not later. So, uh... This has been Charles Random Things in the morning. And YouTube, you shall get this stream or this recording um, maybe an hour later. So, with that being said, thank you for watching and see you in space, cowboy, as they would say in Cowboy Beep. I don't know, whatever. See you guys later.